Hello, good morning. Today it's gonna be a little bit more. Oh, oh my god. Oh, god, you scared the crap out of me. I'm sorry, did I hurt you? No, it's fine. I wasn't even saying. We're gonna be just doing errands. It's gonna be a little yeah, bit more chill. Haircuts, finally. Haircuts, uh, probably a little grocery shopping. We're visiting with the parents, and uh, we're gonna go over there right now and have some breakfast and then just visit for a while. A few moments later. We're here. You decent? Are you decent? Me? Six hours later. All right, so as you can see, we went ahead and got our haircuts. Well, at least you can see mine, Patrick. There you go. This is me, I'm so royal, and you all wanna be brown. Yes, uh, we didn't really vlog too much just because it's it's really awkward vlogging while you're in a place that's full of people doing, you know, personal things like getting their hair cut. Um, what are you grabbing at back there? All right, so what we're going to do now is uh, I'm going to cook dinner. That's why I'm wearing my crusty, almost a crusty crab, no, but the crusty burgers. I love this thing. I love the Simpsons Land at Universal. That's where we got this. So. Um, he's gonna be in here. I'm gonna show you in a second this mess that we're living in right now in the the office slash guest room It's more of our office though. Patrick is reorganizing it moving things around because it has uh, It has to be used a little bit more now that we're working on some new stuff and uh, we need well more like he needs an adequate space Ooh, to, Adequate space to do it so let me show you what he's working on and then we'll head over to the kitchen. Something that I really like about this new setup, we used to have this sucker like over here, but you would be facing the wall and now, this was my idea too by the way. So this is going to be now, when you sit down you can face out and look at the trees and traffic. <laughs> and, the trees. and trees and traffic. And oh, look oh, who's there here. she is, the there one and only Peppa Roo. Ba -da 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 -da. This is going to be where he does most of his work. We're putting the printer over here on this cute little thing. We used this and bought this for the fraternity, uh, the little mini series that we had on this channel not too long ago. Not too long ago, but it's no longer. It's no longer. And this was the set of it, but as you can see, look at this. This is insane. This is my grandma's like antique buffet set. That's the back of it, though. But we love this thing, and we're going to still use it. But we are going to be repainting this, possibly, and just organizing. This is all this crap here that you see on the floor. This is like all inside of our closet. We're so we're taking that out. We're, we're trying to make this, like he said earlier, multifunctional. And that is the word, because we may or may not be coming out with a few new shows and we need spaces to film them at. Yay! <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> but tonight I am going to attempt to, uh, and I use that word like strongly, I am attempting to make tostadas, tostadas homemade tostadas, chicken, uh, refried beans, cheese, I don't have Woo! lettuce, we didn't do lettuce but it's okay without lettuce. Da, da, da. So you guys can hang out with me while I try to do that. All right. Just that a time. Just that a time. Have fun. Have fun. Have fun cleaning the office. This is fun for me. <laughs> it is. See you later. Bye. Bye. All right. So what we're gonna do is I have already started out here with boiling the chicken. Let me show you what that looks like. There we go. I have um, some broth in there. Just salt and pepper. Nothing. Nothing too crazy. Pretty basic. I've been stirring it occasionally. Now the chicken breasts are from Publix. They are the boneless, skinless chicken breasts. Now these apparently don't have to be thawed out and I did actually thaw them out. I didn't read the front where it says they're individually frozen so there's no need to thaw. I don't know what that means. I'm not really that clever in the kitchen. I'm sure most of you know your way around the kitchen and know how to cook properly so you're probably going to watch this and cringe and be like, why is he doing that? I don't know, I, I'm not the best, but I make do, and my food is pretty decent, and Patrick loves it. Patrick always compliments it, so that's the most important thing. He's my toughest critic, the most important critic, and uh, yes, yeah, so if you guys have a Publix near you, you're in luck because their chicken is fantastic. If you don't, stock up next time you come to Florida, if you can, if it's possible. I don't think it's going to be possible, but they have a great meat department, and yes, I am totally naked right now. 
just kidding. I'm not. I'm not. Patrick said I couldn't do that. I had to wear, I had to wear something for this video. So I have my, my apron that I love and some shorts. So I have to keep it PG for you guys. Disappointed! All right, Pepper, you are so excited, aren't you? Oh, look here. She's licking her lips. But as you can see here, took the lid off. This is boiling nicely and it smells really good with the bouillon cube and salt and pepper. Probably the pepper is what we're selling out. Does salt have a smell? I don't think it does. But it looks good. So the part I'm mostly scared about when it comes to this and cooking this is going to be using this other burner for the, to, the actual like tostada thing, the, the tortilla and frying that. I've never fried anything before. So that should be interesting. Very interesting. I don't know how I feel about it. That's why I'm going to be wearing this because you do not want any hot oil popping onto your skin as most of you know, if not all of you know, and you probably experienced it. I've experienced it with other people cooking. My dad used to fry so much stuff. He was always frying things and um, it hurts. So that's why I invested in this sucker. All right, so I opened up this can of refried beans and it looks, <laughs> it doesn't look good, it doesn't look appetizing, but it's, it is delicious. Um, what I'm gonna do though, real quick, I thought I wanna check this and make sure these are good to go. And so I'm gonna pull one of them out, one of the smaller ones, and start pulling it apart. I'm gonna put all the chicken inside here. I really wish I had three hands right now because I'd love to be able to hold the camera and do this, but it's really hard to do. So I'm gonna try to set it up, but yeah. Oh yeah, I know you can't probably tell on camera, but this is really delicious, Pepper. This is not for you though. Oh my gosh, you're so cute though, hold on. There you go. And that's why she she always begs, because we give in to that face. How could you say no to that? Um, Try this. What is it? It's chicken. You did this? I did that. Oh my gosh, she's dancing for more. Wow. I'm impressed. My parents would be impressed. They would. That's really good. That tastes like my mom's chicken. So, <laughs> keep up the good work. Oh my hey. gosh, I have the thumbs up from Patrick. I'll sleep easy tonight. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and pull the rest of the chicken out, pull it apart, uh, keep it warm, and then get everything else going over here. I'm really dreading and not looking forward to frying up these tortillas. I'm so scared of getting burnt. Alright, so the beans are in here warming up and then I'm going to go ahead and use this as my tester. So I have the oil in here, have it on a little over medium high heat and going to just use this to see when it's ready and start popping those out and they should only be in there for like a minute I've read. So, yep. All right, so far so good. I have the tester turning golden brown here, and it's definitely gotten harder, so it's a good sign. Uh, this looks good as well. Chicken is just it's ready to go. But I'm gonna just keep the tortillas, I'm gonna lay them on this here so they can get some of the grease off. And over this way, here we have our cheese ready to go, which is the best part. All right, so as you can see, I've done three here that have come out, I think, looking really good. And this one is done here. Now I'm the type of person, I know some people don't like anything to have any type of crisp to it or burnt to it, but I do like my stuff, like toast and stuff, I like it to be dark. So like this is perfect for me. But I think Patrick likes this. The first one I think will be his favorite one, because look at that, that is golden. But I like to mean mine to be dark, so. But I gotta keep going here, I gotta keep these things going. As you can see, there's a lot. We're not eating all these tonight, but there is, obviously, we have a big appetite. We eat a lot, so I got quite a few of these to make. All right, so that was crazy. That was very, come sit down, please. <laughs> I know it's kind of smoky in here because some of these burnt a little on the edges, <laughs> like over here, but, so we have our. Gosh, don't, you guys, are, they're gonna look at this and go, wow, they eat a lot. Don't show that. We do eat a lot. <sighs> we got our cheese, beans, and the chicken, which is delicious. Oh. Actually, I'm gonna eat that right now. Oh my God. But I'm sorry, Pepper, she's not fixate. Oh, she's not. Yes, I'm fixate. Oh. Oh. Eyes are watering. Make yours up, 
Tell me what you think, and then we'll eat. So you got your beans on first, and then you go for the chicken, right? Yeah. Or do you do cheese? I think I'm gonna do cheese on top of the beans, that way the cheese doesn't fall off. Give it a try, give it a try. It's not hot, don't worry. Don't watch me. Yeah. Mm. Mm. I'm taken back to my roots and my casa with my rug carpet waiting for my abuelita to make me my tostadas. It's delicious. Ridiculous. All right, well that will do it. I'm gonna take a seat and eat and actually take this off and go ahead and eat. Thank you, thank you. Um, but thank you guys so much for joining us. This wasn't the most exciting vlog, but um, yeah, we haven't had too much going on this week outside the apartment. But uh, make sure you subscribe, click on the notifications bell so you know when we're uploading videos. We do Monday Fun Day, which is our live stream on Monday, so we'll see you then. And also, if you are looking for theme park inspired apparel, make sure you check out ink and paint threads .com. But most importantly, remember, you, you can, can do, do the impossible. impossible. Bye, guys. Bye, guys. Pepper, say goodbye. Pepper, say goodbye. Yeah. Gonna, that's my seat. You're not going to sit there. Okay.